I'm Abel Gleason. I'm a pilot, rotor wing captain with Life Flight. I've been in Life Flight since 2021. We're going to talk about night vision goggles. So we have the NVGs or nods or goggles so that we can mount them to our helmet and inside of the aircraft get a better view of where it is that we're flying and where it is that we're landing. And the way that the night vision goggles do that is by using battery power to amplify ambient light. So there has to be some light in order for us to be able to see something. And the goggles through the wonders of technology and a whole bunch of components inside of the tubes themselves actually amplify that light by stepping it up through a photocathode and bumping up the number of electrons that are passing through the goggles and then presenting us an amplified image of what we see. It's generally about two to 3,000 times light amplification from the ambient light. So even if we have starlight and that's the only light we have, it will still amplify that light to the point where we have an indelible image of what we're looking at. If we have about a 50% lunar illumination night, that's actually just about the perfect amount for the goggles. If we have a full moon night with a clear sky, it will bump up the light so much that we actually get what's called scintillation. And the goggles literally don't know what to do with all that light. So they'll cause halos and the stars will look like they're sparkling. And because it does that, and it does it indiscriminately, if we look into a bright light source like headlights or uh, the emergency lighting from ambulances, the goggles have to be able to step that down because it can damage the components that are inside. So there are two things on the goggles that it does to protect itself and then to protect us. So it has on the objective lens, which are the two lenses on the outside, what's called bright source protection, and it will actually cut the power down to those lenses so it doesn't take in as much light to amplify. And then we have what's called automatic brightness control on the eyepiece lenses here. And that's to make it so that it's actually making it so that we don't bleach out our what whatever night vision we have by dimming down the light that we see on this side. And it's doing that all the time automatically just if the light goes above a certain limit. That's what we have.